Hey everyone, it is Andrew here from iDownloadBlog. Today I'm going to highlight two new features for macOS Sierra and iOS 10. And first up on that list is the Shared Desktop and Documents folder. I'm going to open up System Preferences and head to the iCloud Settings pane. I'm then going to go to iCloud Drive and select Options. Inside of here, there is a new option on top called Desktop and Documents folders. I'm going to make sure that that is checked and that will enable my desktop and document folders to sync completely between my Mac here as well as other Macs or my iPhone and iPad running iOS 10. So I've gone ahead and selected that and you can see we have this now updating because I added a new file to my desktop. iCloud is updating as well as if I go to desktop, the individual file you can see is also loading there as it's uploading that to iCloud Drive. And that is this file here actually. So if I jump over to my iPhone running iOS 10, I can open up the iCloud Drive icon that was introduced in iOS 9. And in here we have a new folder called Desktop. Inside of Desktop, you can see I have one file and it is that same file that I add to the desktop on my Mac. This is a great feature for a number of reasons. It allows me to bring common files that I access frequently to my iPhone and iPad. But if I have multiple Macs, like a desktop and a laptop, anything that I'm like, you know, saving often, I can just save right to my desktop, kind of like I already do, and it'll be just synced across the platforms. So I'll add something to my desktop on my Mac Mini, and it's going to show up right here at my MacBook Air. So a great new continuity feature. Next up is Universal Clipboard. There are a lot of third-party applications that do that, but now Apple will do it natively, and it works really well. I simply have iCloud signed into on both my new devices here running macOS Sierra and iOS 10. I copied Apple on my Mac and I could paste it right away on my iPhone. It even works with images and other large files. So if I copy my image here, go to my iPhone, hit paste, you'll see there's a little pop-up window just for a second as it loads and transfers this file. And there we go, I've easily just copied something on my Mac and pasted it on my iPhone. And of course it works in reverse as well. I can go ahead and copy the word Apple again, jump back to my MacBook and command V, paste it right there, it copies straight across. So another great feature, this works on anything on macOS Sierra or iOS 10. macOS Sierra and iOS 10 are both right now in developer preview with a public preview coming in July and a full release to everybody this fall. If you have any questions on any of these new features, let us know in the comments. Please go ahead and subscribe for all of our latest videos. And until next time, this is Andrew for iDownloadBlog.